after you have added the document to the project, the next step is that you take a few minutes to say something about the nature of each one of the documents that you are going to analyze. You will open the document manager. This is a window where you are going to see the list of your documents. If you click on one of them, the preview of that document will show below. On the right side below, that is where you are going to write the comment, which is really a brief description of, of, of that particular source of information. So here I am going to say that this is a, uh, an, a, a Wikipedia article discussing community health agents in Brazil. You can say more like uh, more than that. For example, if you are doing a focus group session, probably you are going to say something about uh, the number of participants in the session, uh, where it took place. Uh, maybe if there is something to be said about the quality of the focus group session, then that is the place where you're going to do that. Uh, basically, you are going to write uh, whatever you feel that is going to help you um, as perhaps as the context of that document, something that is going to help you as you engage in the actual analysis of that document. I always tell people that um, it's also a good idea to have an appendix in your report uh, with a list of the documents and a few words about what they are. So this is precisely where you're going to do this. This is a picture, photograph taken in a school in Rio de Janeiro during a vaccination campaign. This is a video, and uh, the, the preview of videos are uh, still not available in Atlas DI 8 Windows, but it's going to be available. And uh, here in the comment, you are going to write a uh, video uh, recorded at a health center in Rio de Janeiro, okay, on, let's say, May the 25th. 2013 and so on and then you go one by one and you are gonna do that now what I would like to suggest to you is that once you have done that you go to report and create a simple output uh, of the list of documents with their comments which is what you can add as an appendix uh, of your reports and the, 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 the output should include uh, the comments. And I guess that is all. Uh, the comments, the type of content, no. Date, dates and users, no. Yeah, I guess that is all you would like to, to, to include. So here it is. The name of the document and what you wrote as a comment. This is a, a Word uh, document. You can save it externally uh, as PDF or Word. OK, so that is what I wanted to tell you about uh, commenting documents, which, by the way, is not a, a technical requirement of working with Atlas TI. You can perfectly find uh, do without writing these comments but I would say that um, not doing that can limit the potential for a good analysis. Thank you. Bye-bye.